like everybody know about Baccarat. Everybody know about Baccarat. Everybody know. Everybody know. Everybody know. So what is up, you guys? It's your girl Nice G, also known as Glenn C, and welcome to the family, y'all. If you're new here, then welcome, welcome, welcome. If you already subscribed, then you know how this go. So I am back with one of my favorite kind of videos. I'm gonna keep putting them out until y'all keep appreciating them. I sure as hell am, and that is a perfume video. Okay, so I am back with my summer must-have fragrances because, baby, we heading into the summertime. We heading into the hot. The hot months. It has been hot all week in Jersey and now there's a rainstorm outside because the weather don't know what it want to do. But baby, if you want to smell good, you want to smell like a bush, you want to smell like a bat all summer, then this video is for you. Keep on watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let's get it. Let's go. Okay, guys. So I have four, I'm sorry, five fragrances to mention to you guys. And some of these are repeats that have been on my channel for a while and some of them are new. So let's jump right into it. The first things first, I mentioned them is Gucci. I'm sorry. Gucci, Flora, Lavender, Gorgeous, Gardenia, uh, Eh, De Toilette. Some of these toilets, some of these are perfumes. If you don't know the two, toilets are more oil-based than perfumes. That's all I'm going to say about that. I have mentioned this in my spring faves or my spring must-haves. If you didn't go watch it, boo. It's right there above because you should have watched it. It is this very, very, very tacky, ugly packaging right here. I said this before on my channel. I do not like this packaging. But baby, but baby. This right here, this is right here. First of all, a guy brought me this, and I was like, "You trying to, you trying to, you trying to, now you trying to wipe me up? I gotta run!" But literally, this perfume is so bomb for the summertime. I have my iPad here because I'm gonna just read off the notes to you guys really quickly. So this is a floral family, fruity floors, red berries, pear, white gardenia. Fragrance description is the scrumptious white floral gardenia is Gucci's faithful creation to the perfect gardenia. It exudes sultry, sensuality, and lush, luscious, insinuating. Men are drawn to her as bees blossoming in the flowers. Exactly. When I say this perfume, it's just like, oh, what you got on? Like, okay, like, right, you like how I smell? I don't know that's right. This perfume is literally perfect for any date night, any brunch, any girl's day. If you want to throw it on and go grocery shopping, you can. I personally like to wear it. Um, at night because to me it's just a little bit more alluring at night during the day don't get me wrong it's very pretty but i just feel like at night and you walking past somebody and they're like mm, what, do, what do she got oh like that's that's the perfume that this one is and again it is the gucci flora ardenia lavender it's a very long name and it's limited edition so go grab it if you haven't period it's linked down below you're welcome next set okay let's get through this quick baby the next one is another girl that i think i have mentioned on my channel i'm really not sure she may have been in my spring Perfumes, but again, spring and summer, you could get away with a lot of the same scents. So we're gonna mention her again. It is my girl right here, Miss Valentino, Donna Yellow Dream, and the perfume. This girl right here, she is, I did mention this, I did. I mentioned this one too, and I think in the spring. I'm not gonna spray her, cause she's strong, baby. This perfume, if you have the original Born in Roma, then you may like this one, you may not. I personally like this one better than the um, original Born in Roma, and I don't know why, but it has different notes than what I'm typically used to. So I'll read them off to you guys. It is fresh, fresh florals, Italian London. Excuse me, fresh musk, rose essence. Now, that lemon you can smell, that musk you can smell. And that is something that is so big to me. I love musky scents, y'all. So this right here, again, I wore this out with a dude. And he like, yo, what is that? Like, the musky scents can almost make it a cologne. Now, they do have this in a cologne sense of you and your man want to get matching fragrances. Check check out Miss Valentino, baby. And I have heard a number of females saying they wear the Born in Roma cologne more than the perfume. And I don't know why, because I don't have that one. But this one right here, if you told me this was unisex i would believe you because it is that musky but that lemon and that uh that white floral on top just ugh, gives the perfect i don't even know it just gives it to the gross now where would i wear this to i'm gonna tell you guys where exactly i would wear this to and honestly what i'm wearing it with okay i, I will have on the top like this you see this white fresh in your face period i will wear this to brunch I wear this on a really cute lunch date. I can even wear this in the office. If you got, you know, you walking into an office, you know, maybe predominantly males, predominantly women, it doesn't really matter. I will wear this into the office as that kind of scent. It's not too much like the 
the flowery scent that you know your grandma used to wear you used to be like damn grandma what is that it's more of a musky flower scent so i personally would wear this into anybody's office anybody's boss office like hey how are you my name is t you know that's this the, the best way i can describe this perfume and honestly it is going to be a go-to gym for the summer for me my next perfume is one of my favorite big girl purchases and is by mason francis y'all i had to jump on the gentle fluidity gold if you follow any perfume girls or watch any perfume videos on youtube they are mentioning it mentioning mfk's gentle fluidity gold because she's that girl she's so sweet she's just so light and girly and i honestly smell marshmallow or gourmand i'm really not sure and that was a blind purchase for me i was just watching all the youtube girls and i had baccarat and i was like well if i got baccarat and they say this must smell better than baccarat or like we get off baccarat i gotta get both so i got both all right let me read the notes off to y'all for this one so the notes for this one are juniper berries nutmeg gordinia musk ambery woods and vanilla if you can't peek, if you ain't peeked yet, but your, your girl likes the musk with the vanilla, with the sweet, with the flower. That's me. Like, that's literally, if I could describe myself in a fragrance, it would be like musky sweet. Because that's what I love. This perfume is so freaking girly and, and pretty. It's not a sexy scent. I feel like scents does have, like, you have cute scents, you have sexy scents, you have grown woman scents. This is a, this is a girly scent. This is a feminine this is, like, this bottle exudes femininity. Like, it's just so pretty. I do not know what the silver smells like but the gold baby. Now, where would I wear this to? First of all, I'm wearing this out with my man, okay? Cause it smells like candy, all right? I want him to, I want him to, I want him to nibble on the neck. So I'm gonna put it on the neck. I'm gonna put it on the color I'm gonna put it on the, the back of the neck. Yeah, I want him to get close, close up and be like, what you wearing? Huh? So that's A, hey, that's where I'm wearing now. I'm wearing with my man. I ain't got no man, but God, you hear me though, right? You hear me? Okay. I ain't got no man, but I will wear this if I had one. But if I ain't got one, I'm wearing it to anywhere, dinner, dinner brunch museum out with the girls i'm always out with my girls because like i said i ain't got no man i do go on dates um <laughs> so i'll wear this out on a date but again a day date maybe not really so much a night time dinner date because i feel like it is a little light for the night time i feel like if you're, he's like oh meet me for a late lunch like or early dinner maybe like a five six o'clock dinner you know you never know people's schedules well, you really never know um i'll wear this then like this is the perfect perfume for that for sure and again this one does oh i didn't tell what those retail for this one this one is expensive i ain't gonna tell y'all because i ain't been telling y'all but miss girl she's up there she is she is up there next scent my next baby is something i literally purchased on tuesday of this week and it is right here miss Givenchy. 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 how you want to pronounce it miss irresistible girl when I say it was on my list forever and I never smelled it until this week. And I was, who I'm wearing this tonight. Um, <laughs> I was walking around Ulta like, I don't want none of these perfumes. They, they, I keep buying the same kind of perfumes. When I smelled that one, I said, oh, we're getting her. The notes really quickly. It's a floral family. Again, woody floral. This is a lot, right? Right. Woody floral, sparkling pear, amberite. I don't know what an amberite is or amberite. I don't know. Luscious rose, blonde wood, and musk. This is the, when I say this, now this right here, she's sexy. You have your girly, you have your cute, you have your, this is sexy. This is sexy. She's sexy. I'm wearing it tonight. I'm going to, uh, I'm going on a sister day, but I'm still wearing it because like I said, I ain't got no man. Y'all, I'm going to just, I don't want to spray it because I'm going to smell it when I smell it other perfumes, but y'all, so freaking pretty. It smells so good. I, again, will wear this on a date. I will wear this out with the girls. I, when I, when I put this on, I feel like I'm going to go wine tasting. I'm going to go on someone's rooftop because it, it just, it's sexy. I'm going to have on a strappy top with a little bit of cleave, you know, maybe a, a cute skirt with a high split. This is that girl. Go get her. Go get, go get her. Go get her. She retails for $67. I got the one ounce because that is the perfect size for me because I have so many perfumes, but yeah. This right here, she not missing. She's not missing. This perfume was actually a gift and it's actually a toilet and I don't think I've ever talked about these fragrances on my channel and it's a little different for me, but it is Miss Juicy Couture, Juicy Lafleur. Um, It was a gift, a graduation gift from one of my good friends 
and again she is the epitome of she's cute to me this is not a girly perfume. it's girly but she gives me cute look at the bottle it gives me cute it gives me young I, I don't know i always can i can uh, i always compare like juicy couture to like high school but no as a grown woman you can rock this you can you can and it depends on you and your body chemistry you can rock this so let me read off the notes to you guys so these notes are wild berries mandarin white lily honeysuckle gardenia petals soft jasmine vanilla caramel i didn't know that and sandalwood so again this is up my alley you got the sweet and then you got the sandalwood they combined and made this beautiful bottle right here and this is going to probably be my summer runaround scent so i have perfumes for everything i have perfumes for dinner dates i have perfumes for brunch i have perfumes for like night cap you know this is going to be my runaround scent because it's just that light to me she's very light. you can wear this outside lunch breakfast dinner you can wear it to work this is another good office scent to me like it's not too much in your face, but you're going to smell the person when they walk past. But it's not like, damn, like, why is she drenched in, like, rose petals? Like, it's such a pretty scent. And again, this is girly to me. This is cute to me. This is, like, a cute scent. Like, oh, I'm going to grab brunch with my grandma. I don't know. I'm going to grab lunch with my mom. Like, I would throw this on. Um, You know, again, you got a bay. You know, we going grocery shopping. Because I just feel like every moment is a perfume moment. So, baby, we going, we going to Target. This is the scent I'm throwing on, okay? I'm running to Walgreens. I'm running to the doctor. I'm throwing this on this summer. It is just the perfect summer throw on, throw on scent. And again, thank you so much to my agent for gifting it to me. And this is my first Juicy Couture, like, at this big old age. Y'all know I'm 20-something. I'm not telling y'all my age, but I did not have any Juicy Couture in high school. So I am late to the game, but your girl is now put on, and I'm rocking her this summer for sure. My last scent, my very last scent is literally an oldie but a goodie. If you go all the way back to the beginning of my channel and watch my summertime faves, which is my first faves video, this perfume is mentioned. This is the Giorgio Armani Aqua Di Gio. It just says Aqua, yeah, Aqua Di Gio. Okay, this is like my probably my most aquatic perfume, or maybe maybe my only. Um, but it is so bomb and so fresh. I feel like aquatics go really well in the summertime. So let me read off the notes. It is fresh, fresh aquatics, jasmine, gardenia, and warm woods. Anything that is probably up there on my shelf has a warm wood, sandalwood, caramel, some sweet in it. Because baby, I like to smell sweet. This perfume, it's aquatic, but She's grown. She's grown. I don't, she's a grown woman scent. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I, she can, she can be a little sexy, but she's more of a grown woman scent. This, look at how much is in here. And I've had this perfume for like two years. Like I said, go back and watch the channel. And I'm telling you, this is one of my favorite summertime scents. She gives me very much fresh. I love this perfume to wear on dates again. I go on a lot of dates. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't at the front. You gonna be out here dating. Um, still not in a relationship, so that says a lot. Um, <laughs> But she is something I would wear on a date to church, um, to brunch with grandma again, with the, running out with the girls, grabbing a drink. This is her. This is the girl. I also, like, when I wear her, I'm wearing all white. I'm wearing very crisp colors because this is, the, this just puts me in the mind state of an aquatic scent and more so this scent. And again, it's called aqua. So that alone tells you alone that it's going to be more of a aquatic scent. And y'all, she's just... She's grown. Again, you could wear this into the office. You could wear this to work. Again, this is not a scent where it's just like, to me, it's not like Baccarat. Everyone knows Baccarat. It grabs you. It, it captivates you. It's very strong. It lasts for two, three days, baby. You wear wigs like me. You take you take your wig up and put it back on. You go smell back Baccarat. Um, this is not that. This is, it'll, you walk past and it's just like, oh, what, what is that? That smells really good, you know, but it's not something that is obnoxious in your face. But, you know, if you want a date and he get close enough, baby, he gonna, he gonna smell you. Oh, he gonna smell you um so i love her she's so old she sits proudly on my tray with the rest of them she hang with the best of them um and i really believe this is my only aquatic scent i'll take a look at my collection and i'll let you guys know but again go get you if you're looking for a good aquatic scent to add to your collection i would oh not my hair getting caught i would suggest miss um mr or mr mrs Giorgio armani aquatic oh aquatic aqua I keep saying aquatic um but yeah okay that wraps up this video i only gave y'all five fragrances for the summertime i know y'all probably like girl you keep trying to push fragrance on us and we just not biting but i'm gonna keep posting them again and again and again until the 
the girls is really put on because I really try to put the girls on. Like everybody know about Baccarat. Everybody know about Baccarat. Everybody know. Everybody know. Everybody know. But do we all need to smell the same? No. So I'm trying to put y'all on the other scents. And let's just like, y'all really don't. Y'all want to smell the same. Like, I'm sorry. I can't smell the same. Your girl got over like 30 bottles of perfume. I'm not ashamed. That is all for this video. I love you guys so, 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 so much. I'll see you on my next one. Bye, guys. Mwah.